All right, people, let's try this again, okay? <clears throat> Sorry about that. Anyway, what I got for you is I got two trailers I want to do, and I figured, eh, why not, you know? I just really hope to God I... I just hope to God that I can do these right, okay? So the first one I got is for a good movie. At least I think it is. It's the trailer for Cloak and Dagger from 1984. Remember, this movie came out then. And I figured, eh, why not? Why not give, why not give it a shot? The second trailer really needs to be re-edited in the movie frankly does too so people <clears throat> let's let's give this a, let's give this a shot and see how it goes okay here we go and hope to and I pray to God yep good okay good all right here we go Wait, if I wait, is that the kid from ET? And if I recall correctly, wasn't this movie wasn't this movie like wasn't this movie like about a about a kid trying to deliver like a game cartridge to like FBI agents or something? And he had to tell him like some number like. One million three hundred twenty-nine, something like that. As you guys probably have figured out, it has Henry Thomas, Dabney Coleman playing dual role, dual roles. By the way, <laughs> is he always like that? And he, and yes, he has a friend that he. Oh man, dude, why, why did he, why did he yell fire when number one, they're on a river. Yes, this movie takes place in San Antonio, Texas, if I remember correctly. <clears throat> yeah, if I remember correctly. <laughs> so, yes, the dude said Jack Flack. Not Jack Black, like some people might think. Jack Flack, played by Dabney Coleman. And, wait, wait a minute. His dad is also played by Dabney Coleman, so how did they feel like those two, how did they feel... So I'm starting to wonder how they did that. And of course, the most obvious, the most obvious way to do it. Oh my gosh, people. And yes, this is a this is basically one of two videos I've got for I've got one of two trailers I'm gonna do today. Is running out. Yep, it sure is. No, seriously, he can't be more than 11, 12 years old at the time. Wait a minute. Now boarding a flight to Mexico City. Oh, man. Yeah, and if I remember right, the two people who he's trying to stop were actually a couple of spies, if I remember. To God, of these two, this movie's not, this movie's not bad. Yes, it's cheesy at times, and the story doesn't make a little doesn't make hardly any sense. But it's a masterpiece compared to this compared to this piece, this fucking piece of shit. Compared to this shit. And yes, you guys can read the title. I'm not gonna read it because that's because that's not what this is. That's not what this movie is. That's not Harry, and that's not Cheryl. Jesus Christ! How stupid are these are these people? Wait, that says Toluca County, West Virginia. Wait, I thought Silent Hill was based on the town of Centralia, Pennsylvania. Am I missing something here? <clears throat> I mean, 
No, really, am I? Watch this, you guys. What's wrong? Okay, what's wrong with this seed right here? I'm going to leave it right here. What's wrong with this seed? As if you couldn't already have guessed. See? You guys saw that, right? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Wait a minute. Wait. Hang on. Wait. Hang the... Hang on. Wait. Rose crashed, yet her vehicle's not... Not crashed into anything. Yet, in the game, Harry's vehicle clearly looks like it has crashed. What is going on... See, even the trailer couldn't even get this right. You gotta be kidding. You have got to be freaking kidding me. No. That sign should say welcome to not Silent Hill. Because that's not what this is. No, it's Cheryl, you nitwit. Can't she get her name right? Can anyone get this name? Can anyone get that kid's name right? This movie. C H E R Y L. It's not that hard, new people. Jesus. And they couldn't get the town. They couldn't get Silent Hill right. Mysteries without answers are still mysteries, people. Secrets without explanation are still secrets, my friends. Fear without end is still fear. Yeah. And this movie still sucks. And again, if you're going to adapt Silent Hill from game to film, then do it right, please. It's not that freak. It's not that goddamn hard. Oh, God. Once you enter this world... <laughs> there's no turning back. That's right. Because then you'll realize how much they butchered the story of this movie. How much they butchered the story of this movie. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, not Silent Hill in theaters 2006. God, this movie sucks. Yeah, so what do you guys think of that? Did you guys like these trailers? And if you guys do see these videos, I don't know. Maybe give it a like. Share your thoughts in the comments down below. <sighs> Share the video around for those who for those who wish to see. Click the bell to be notified for future videos. And my friends, do not forget to subscribe for more of me and these videos you shall see. But please don't watch the Silent Hill movie. It sucks. Play the game instead. Please.